Tinasi, you my hero. Welcome back, Kane's family, to another film review. We are back at Miami Central, back-to-back -back days. Four-star linebacker Ezekiel Marcellin uh, out of Miami Central commits to Miami. Modern-day linebacker, big, strong, fast. Uh, can get do a lot of things for you, but he's great at getting to the quarterback. Uh, played his seven-on-seven -seven with Raw Miami, so I'm very familiar with him. We call it Cheesy Man, probably one of the funniest people <laughs> you'll ever meet, to be honest with you. Uh, kind of a character. Hope he gets that NIL deal. So they come out with the three receiver set. They motion him off. Now they're bringing him back. So a little delayed blitz comes through. Now it's just one on one. Look where this contact's made right, right here on like 44. But he flies off the damn screen and then he goes and sacks EJ. So again, I think he's really good at getting to the quarterback. He's going to be a go ball, see, um, see ball, get ball type of player. He can play in space for us. This is a big time get right here. This is what I mean by like a modern day linebacker. See him here in the middle. He's going to be dropping zone. Very fluid. Very fluid. Moves really well. Really well. Quarterback's taking off. You're going to go down there and lay some wood. I mean, this guy can close space. He's good in space, covering backs out of the backfield, you know, shooting down. And he's going to let people know uh, when he gets there, bro. He's a big hitter. He's 5'11, 205, 210. You know, he'll be, you know, 215, 220 at Miami, you know, laying at wood. Again, very fluid move. These movement. This is a very big game. You're playing Miami New Orleans. He's gonna get a DN's gonna lose here and get washed down. Instead of getting caught up in that cotton, that great awareness, good footwork, gonna get right around, eyes on it, eyes on it. Go ahead and get to the quarterback. I mean, guy moves really well in space, bro. He's a modern day linebacker. Run, hit. Uh, last one, linebacker we got out of Miami Central, uh, you know, Wesley Saint. And I think uh, we're gonna see his best football coming up this season. So I would love to keep that pipeline going. What I mean by a modern day linebacker, you got trips out here to the field side. It's man coverage. They're going to swing that, send that back out. This is supposed to create a rub. These guys aren't really running routes. They're just, you know, putting it out here and trying to get a block. Automatically understand space. So he gets underneath that and just a straight line to the uh, to the running back on the swing. Going to lay that wood when he gets there. And just look at the movement skills. It slips underneath. Now it's just a straight line race. Uh, running back doesn't catch that ball. Doesn't matter. He's still getting folded. Here he's in the middle. This is versus Bishop Gorman. Quarterback's going to escape out the pocket. He had trips here to the field side. He's drifting, drifting. Quarterback's able to step up. Once he breaks this tackle, he has this whole sideline. So here goes Ezekiel right here. EJ's going to hop that boy in. I mean, just first off, these quarterbacks like that. But um, second of all, EJ, open field space. Look at that size. He could run. He could move. He could hit. He's one of the most sure tacklers in South Florida. Once he gets his hands on you, you are not getting away. Excellent on his feet, can move in space. So this is going to hit a screen here to the running back. So instead of going up, you know, attacking this offensive lineman, just, you know, run straight into him. See that little subtle move to dip right underneath him, dip his shoulder like if he was running a release as a receiver. Dip that shoulder, get away from that contact, and then shoot that gap uh, to close. Instincts, but also, again, just really good in space. He's a modern-day linebacker. He's going to dip under contact. He's going to shoot gaps. He's going to shoot lanes. 
He's going to cover in space. Little trouble on the snap here. Um, it gets to the quarterback. I think he was just clapping or just straight up just dropped it. Um, but you'll see Ezekiel here slip underneath that lineman uh, and shoot down there. I mean, he's a see ball, get ball type of player. He's downhill. He's a freak athlete, dog. I mean, you've seen him jumping in the pit at OT7 when doing the Superman pose. I mean, he was up there for like 10 minutes. Uh, I mean, Zeke, he's a real deal. Again, just moves really well, so he's always in position to make the play. Again, that orbit motion going, trying to get the defense flowing this way. Then cut back here on the on the zone. To get that double team in center, trying to get up to, uh, to Ezekiel here. Great job just slipping that, moving, moving. Again, very sure tackle this again versus Booker T. Washington. You're seeing his tape versus, you know, Miami Northwestern. These are the best teams down here to play against. Uh, and, you know, Miami Central puts them on the schedule. New Orleans, uh, as we've seen and we're going to see next coming up. But, again, just great job just getting feeling for the run game, shooting down, and he's just able to get to the athletes in space. I mean, he was already past the hashes. You're getting, to a, you're getting a skill guy on the ground relatively easily. Nicest kid in person and the funniest kid, honestly. Uh, but in pads – we need these type of bullies on here. This special team, this versus Miami Northwestern. I mean, you just sending us uh, a message. You know what I'm saying? Just a forcer out there, big teen off on a guy, get everybody hyped up. I mean, that's what big boy football is about. Again, Booger T trying to get that over motion, get that defense flowing this way. Running back makes that cut, which is the correct cut to the outside. Maybe a little bit of a hold there, but again, Ezekiel able to just shoot that and close that space down. No lineman is going to get up to him. Buddy already started watching the play. Like, all right, he gone. Let me just see if he tackled my dog or not. <laughs> Again, this is why I refer to him as a modern day linebacker because you know, here he is in coverage, not staying still, moving around. There's going to be an in route here. Quarterbacks are going to try to go ahead and get to moving around, moving around, closing, uh, closing throwing lanes. You know, you know, disrupting the quarterback. So he's trying to get the throw that doesn't like it. Has to step up, and now he's out of time. You're just getting closing. One thing about this tape, you've seen it all. He could play in space. He's fast, but he's getting to the quarterback. I would have to believe that somehow, some way, uh, when he's in a, at Miami, there's going to be blitz packages. There's going to be a bunch of things going because he's too good of a pass rusher. We had a guy like Malik Bryant who uh, now we're getting him, you know, more involved in the pass rushing game. Again, verse Booker T getting to the line of scrimmage. Getting to the quarterback, just able, knows how to move, maneuver around to free up space and then shoot with that athleticism. Slips by the guard here, and the next thing you know, it's a party at the quarterback. Here he is in space here, trips here. They're trying to get this pass out to the running back and the swing. Going to defeat this blocker with physicality, and then in the open field, uh, help clean up here, bro. That's enforcer-like stuff here. This is a big game. You're playing against Booker T. Washington. A lot of things are on the line. Uh, just don't let that guy go down to the ground like that. Let's go, you know, make a guy, you know, regret catching that football. And uh, that's the type of enforcer he is. That's going to wrap this up. Kane's family, welcome to the UEZ.